today I am starting another reading vlog and I'm super excited for this one because I'm going to be finishing a series that I've been reading for technically 12 years because I did first start this series when I was in like I don't know third grade or something but I only read the first couple of books and then earlier this year I started reading the series again and I read like four of them in a rather short succession but then I just didn't read the fifth one for a while so I think it's finally time that I finish up the series and I'm so excited this series is Percy Jackson and the Olympians so I'm going to be reading obviously the last Olympian I am so hyped to see how the series ends I think it's gonna be so good I literally have no clue what happens like plot wise at the ending I have somehow managed to avoid spoilers for 12 years too so it's just really exciting and i am just so excited to finally be getting to this one shannon this one's for you i know i've been saying i'm gonna finish this book for like the last three months of the summer but finally it is time and we're gonna record it so yes I'm gonna read this one this week for sure and then i am going back to college at the end of this week on like saturday i think so i have about a week so i have a lot of packing to do but while I'm doing that packing, I'm going to be listening to my audiobook that I'm currently listening to. And that is Well Played, I think, by Jen DeLuca. It should be the second book in this like little romance series that takes place at a renaissance fair. I listened to Well Met a couple of weeks ago and it was so good. So I'm so excited to be following different characters from the same fair. As for what I've done so far today, I went on a walk this morning with my mom, which is really nice. And now we're about to like just do some grocery shopping pretty boring but when i get back from grocery shopping hopefully i can start the last olympian so yes gonna do that it's gonna be fun i hope you enjoy the vlog i also forgot to mention that i did hit 300 subscribers this morning and i just wanted to take a moment to thank you all for subscribing and liking my videos and commenting it literally means so much to me. I love talking to you guys about books. I'm just so grateful that you are all deciding to stick around. Oh, it just makes me so happy. So yeah, now we're actually gonna get into the vlog. started off with a bang but this is like oh there's like a lot going on and i loved it i'm so excited to see what the rest of this book holds because just the first chapter was so it's just so much going on i'm so excited i have made it up to chapter four i'm really enjoying this book so far i definitely feel like it's going to be a five star just so many things have happened in the first couple chapters of this book i'm like oh my god like it's just so fast paced so far and i'm just very excited about it because I've been in a mini reading slump recently like I've only read two books so far in August which like isn't not a lot like who am I to say how many books is a lot of books to read in a month but I just normally read more books you know so I've just been not really feeling it recently and I've been wanting to feel it so this is great because I feel like with so much needing to be resolved in the next like 350 pages it's gonna be really fast paced which is what I craving so very excited i don't know if you can see it but i have a bunch of books stacked in front of my bookshelf back there that i needed for a video that i recently filmed but now they're kind of just all over my room and i need to put them on my shelf because my shelf looks sad and my room's a mess so um cleaning montage then i'm gonna eat some dinner then i'm gonna read some more so let's see. a fourth of the way through the book and it's like midnight right now so I'm pretty tired so I'm gonna go to sleep and I will talk to you tomorrow and happy Monday morning, I believe. 
This morning I went for a walk with my mom again, which was super nice. I filmed a video and I'm just downloading some of the footage onto my computer. And then last night I made it up to page 95 of The Last Olympian. Again, I'm just really enjoying this book. One of my favorite like animals, like the giant hellhound Mrs. O'Leary showed up. And I just, I love animals in books. So, you know, a hellhound is close enough to a dog that I was excited to see her. So um, I'm about to film some more videos. I've been pre-filming a bunch of videos because school is stressful, but I still want to be able to upload in the fall and stuff because I just, fall videos are my favorite things, but it's so hard for me to film like while I'm in school, in class, like editing videos is fine, but like finding the time to like make myself look good, film a video is just difficult. So I wanted to just do it now so I could have them done and ready to go. Yes, I'm gonna go change into something black. I need to take down all my Halloween decorations. It's August, but I'm gonna do that. And I don't know what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day, so. Good morning everybody it is tuesday morning and last night i made it up to page 141 so i'm on chapter 9 now i was hoping to get a little bit further in it but it's like i don't even care so it's all good i feel like something really big just happened and i'm very interested to see how this is gonna play out in the rest of this book because i feel like this is a bold move i'm just gonna leave it at that so um yes i'm gonna read a little bit more of this this morning but mainly I need to clean. I just feel like I'm constantly cleaning my room because every time I film more videos, I get like a bunch of books down from my shelves and then I have to clean it up again. And it's a real pain. Should be a decently productive morning. everybody and happy wednesday last night i made it up to page 240 of the last olympian so i am over halfway through it i'd probably say i'm like two thirds of the way through it maybe and it's just so many twists and turns are showing up one of my favorite characters from the last couple of books has also shown up so that's really fun too but honestly like that's that's all i have to update on it's super fast paced and really entertaining so i'm having a really good time reading this i'm very upset that I, it took me this long to get to this book. So this is a good time. I've also been listening to a lot of my audiobook this morning and oh my God, something, I can't say what, but something just happened and I'm like, Ugh. And I thought I read something like this on the back of the book, but I guess I just forgot it. So if you wanna read this book, don't read the back of the book because Oh my god, it just really, it really took me out. I was like, oh my god. So far, it's been a great reading week. I'm just having a fantastic time. So, I am going to go with my mom to her hair appointment. And while I do that, I'm going to read some more of The Last Olympian, and then we're gonna get lunch. And then I'm gonna come home and film some more videos. I actually filmed one this morning. So there's like a big stack of books that um, I, again, need to put back on my shelves. And then, I'm gonna do some packing because I do move out in a couple of days and I haven't packed anything, so that's no bueno. That's kind of the update for this morning. So 
as you saw in the last clip, I did read some more of The Last Olympian. I think I'm now on page 200 and... 90 maybe so I'm about 70% of the way through the book and it's really hitting me now that I don't want this series to end and I feel like this is why I didn't read the last book of the series for so long because I hate finishing series like it just makes me so sad like even if the series ends on a happy note I'm still like damn what do I do now that's really fun I've been filming a video uh, for the last couple of minutes here packed up my books for school in that video so that's productive i guess um and i still have so much more packing to do so i'm gonna do some packing and i'm going to listen to the audiobook for well played some more i'm about 50 percent of the way through it and i'm so enjoying it like i i don't know what it is i'm not usually into romance but here we go i'm thoroughly entertained also i really like the main character the character is a little like stereotypical like like pumpkin spice lattes post selfies on instagram but honestly once you can look past it she's actually really likable and i enjoy reading from her perspective probably even more than i enjoyed the first main girl in well met like i still like emily but i think i like I'm so blanking. I know her name. I just can't think of it right now. After googling it, um, don't want to admit that, but <laughs> her name is Stacy. Look, don't, just don't talk about it. Today I'm coming at you from my um, my hair cutting corner. My bangs are getting very long and I was gonna let them grow out but I'm thinking about cutting them, maybe like an inch off of them. So I'm gonna do that while I update the vlog. So first I have to section these out. And in case you're concerned, um, I cut my bangs myself all the time. Like I cut them by myself in the first place and every time I give them a trim, I do it myself. So I feel like I have a decent idea of what I'm doing. So don't you, uh, don't you worry about me. That's for Percy Jackson. Lots of things are happening. We're in like the middle of the big battle right now. So we're in the middle of the big battle right now. Things are happening. People are showing up. I'm having a good time personally. I'm on page 321. So I have like 50 pages left. So maybe I'll finish this like later tonight or maybe I'll finish it tomorrow night when I get like settled and everything. So that'll be nice i'll be able to finish this within the vlog i'm usually not into like big battle sequences that go on for like for a really long time but i just love rick riordan storytelling like it's fantastic so i don't even mind like seeing all the twists and turns of this battle the action sequences are just everything i love them so much it's really fun i think it's going to do a really interesting part and i just cannot wait to see how this book ends i feel like i'm going to be so sad when i read the last page but that's a bridge to cross another time that's not now so i'm gonna go take actually i don't know if i'm gonna take a shower these kind of just fell how i wanted them to so good day so it's later and we took my chair out of my room and now it just looks sad in here i haven't read anything today but i do think i'm going to sit down and where is it Ooh read just a little bit of The Last Olympian. I don't think I'm gonna finish it because it's like 11.30 right now and I have to get up early tomorrow because I'm leaving tomorrow. So I'm gonna read just a little bit of this to relax before I go to sleep. And then I'll talk to you sometime tomorrow. I, I don't know. <laughs> this morning and I finished the last 20 pages of The Last Olympian and 
I'm sad, <laughs> like to be honest. Like just the fact that I started reading this series in like third grade and now that I'm like 20, almost 21, I just finished it. It's like an, it's like an emotional time for me to be honest. Like I'm gonna give this book a five out of five stars. I think it was absolutely fantastic. Rick Riordan's storytelling is just so, oh, it's something special. Let me tell you, it's just so, Good. I'm sure you all know this like I'm this is not new information but it's just wild to think that I'm finally done with this series I don't know what to um what to do <laughs> um as for my other reading this week I read I think I'm at like 90 or maybe it's just 85 percent of well played I think and I'm very much enjoying that book as well i think i might give it a five out of five stars i'm having such a good time listening to it like oh, i don't know i just love the main character like it's really fun to read from her point of view and i just think the storyline is so fun and cute i love the fact that it's set at a ren fair of course um i haven't finished it yet so i don't know if there's going to be like a like a third act conflict kind of thing but um we will see. We shall see. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Maybe I'm gonna put a couple more clips of me moving, but um, for the most part, this is kind of just the end of the vlog. My makeup is done. So I'm going to go do more moving things and I will show you a little bit of my apartment later. So that'll be exciting. And yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of that and then I'm gonna end the vlog.